Hello, everyone. I'm going to mute this because it's getting annoying. Hello, everyone. Today is the day we've all been waiting for. The Q&A. So, I'll be answering any question that I submitted before last night at 8 o'clock. Um, so, yeah, I mean, so... There's quite a bit. There's more than I ever thought. And just like the comic says, um, just like the comic says, I'm sorry if you didn't get a chance to submit your questions. Um, but yeah, this is an awesome. Yeah, it's crazy. It's crazy. It's crazy. I love every single one of them. Um, but. Yeah, let's go ahead and get into the Q&A with all the questions and stuff. But real quick before we do, I want to clear up some confusion that started yesterday. Um, I started the live stream. And it was pretty much just ear-piercingly bad. Um, it, it, I had a memory leak, so it was just... It just took over my camera, and yeah, uh, I wouldn't be surprised if somewhere there was a virus. So, yeah, um, I'm gonna try a, another app that JDL uses here, um, and we're gonna try to do his app. Um, so yeah, let's go ahead and, and yeah, and then so today I will live stream. Make sure, um, you tune in for that. Um, it should just be. We'll be talking about the end of the tutor movement. We'll be talking about a bunch of other stuff. I'll be giving out mod to a bunch of my OGs. I'll be, it'll be a fun time. And then you can discuss stuff with me. It'll be fun. So, yeah, I just wanted to publicly announce that so people show up. Um, so, yeah, I'll see, see you all in a minute. The first question is a bit of an oddball. It's from Wild Lego Films. And it says, hey, congratulations, thank you. I'm so happy for you, man. I'll subscribe and help you reach 100. Yeah, my goal is to reach 100 by the end of the year. We're already at 60, so yeah, let's try to push through that. Um, this is my question. Do you wear braces? Also, I would love if you'd see my channel and maybe subscribe. I did. So do I wear braces? Yes, I do wear, wear braces. I wear braces. I wear herb appliance. It is painful. It is getting more and more hard to eat. It is just so annoying. If you don't know what a herb appliance is, look it up on Google. It's it's pretty much a big hunk of metal in your mouth, and it's on top of the braces. But yes, I do wear braces. So let's go ahead and go on to the next comment. If I could. Intelligent Brick asks, "What is your favorite clone?" My favorite clone is the, uh, um, my favorite clone, well, my favorite clone that's not Lego is, my favorite non-Lego clone trooper is Commando Sev, I think, I just love that guy, I don't know, I think Commando Sev, Captain Rex, and the Five are my top three. Um, if you're talking about Lego, the 212 Airborne Trooper, but yeah, let's go ahead and move on. Awesome Roddy here er, asks, Muckamanians, what got you into LEGO Star Wars? Um, what got me into LEGO Star Wars? Well, got me back into LEGO Star Wars because I've had LEGO Star Wars since I was a baby. <laughs> Seriously. Um, that meme where I've been in this fight since I was six years old is completely true for me. And the thing that got me back into Lego Star Wars, well, there was two things. I started watching MNR again, and I wanted to do videos like him. I started doing like and started buying Lego Star Wars sets, and then Star Wars Clone Wars season seven was the big one. As soon as that came out, I was like, "Crap! I really want Star Wars sets now." And then I was just rocking in a Barnes and Noble one day and then I was just because we were just picking out some books. <laughs> I saw uh, two sets 
my first ever Star Wars reviews, picked them up, and yeah, I made a review on them, so yeah, that's how I got into Lego Star Wars, it's an odd story. Yeah. Lego Productions coming in with a list here, um, congratulations, thank you, um, Q his quest, he has a list of questions, first one is, what Star Wars set do you want the most? I Palpatine's arrest. That's a set. Palpatine's arrest, and I think the Venator are pretty close. Are two sets that I really want. But if you pointed, if you pointed a gun at my head, with a stud shooter at my head, to say, and said, and told me to to pick one, I would pick Palpatine's arrest. I mean, the figures are just glorious. I, I I really want it, and just the prices, man. I want the entire set. So, what favorite TAC fig? At the moment that I have, if you're watching this ahead of time, my CAC order has not came in yet. So, it's at the time it is Commander Se Commando Sev. I mean, Commando Sev. What TAC do you want the fig? Do you want the most? Well, it's not one figure, it's the rest of Delta Squad. If I can do that, one figure, I want five. If you if I have to pick one figure, but yeah, the one that if I if if there's just a figure that is just one that is ever in stock, I am buying the rest of Delta Squad. No without a doubt. Um set from the August Star Wars wave that you want the most. Um it will be, it has to be the 501st Battle Pack. Like, I think that's kind of obvious. Also, we'll be talking about the pushback in my stream, if you want to go join that later today. Favorite Lego Clone Trooper. I said this before, the Airborne 2 Toe Trooper. Favorite droid figure. Ooh, this is an interesting one. It has to be the uh, tactical droid, which I have. It is, is, it is the most unique droid figure that they have made. Yeah. Uh, what made you start making your videos? So, wow, that was a lot, Lego production. So, the last one now, what made me start making Lego videos? I have to say, um, mainly YouTubers. I mean, first, Watermelon, who is my favorite YouTuber. He just inspired me so much. He inspired me to start making mocks. He's just such a cool dude. And I just, I can't, I can't get enough of them. And then, the beta squad's really old, but what really got me into wanting to do animation was Cool Guy. Cool Guy. Whatever the rest of the digits are, he is. <coughs> you don't know, he is a Lego YouTuber. With, that has probably one of the best animators, animation series he's on YouTube. Lego animation series on YouTube, which is the, uh, which is the, uh, Steve the Star Wars story. Yeah, just glorious, so, and plus, the main thing, just, I just wanted to share my opinion with people, and I found people, and that's all I could ever want. Radio and the Masons asks, are you sad? Okay. First off, what is wrong with you and holding down caps lock on weird things? But, uh, I'm gonna put that aside. But, are you sad and can turn to the dark side? Um, yeah. Personally, but personally I like Vader more than Anakin. Um, Anakin in Revenge of the Sith was just a, a, a meanie and he had like a two year old trying to tantrum. him. So, yeah, did not like him. In Revenge of the Sith, Clone Wars Anakin is awesome. I love Clone Wars Anakin, but yeah, I, I have to say, yeah, or no, nah, nah. Well, yeah, it, it was some sad moments, especially with the end, with the high ground and the you are my brother, Anakin. Yeah, that. That was a really sad moment. <laughs>
This one is a pretty unique one. Wow, you have a lot of unique questions. Do you like Mega Constructs more than Lego, or Lego more than Mega Constructs? So, I like, well, I think I, I like Lego at the moment more than Mega Constructs. But I think Mega Constructs is very close to being on par with Lego. And they, Mega Constructs is Lego's biggest rival. Um, and I don't think it's a fully fake Lego. I had this video idea planned, but I scrapped it. Uh, I was just scrapped the video idea. I recorded it and everything. <coughs> but the name Mega Maniacs. Um, well, well, let me finish the other one. But yeah, Lego. Um, I think Mega Maniacs. Me, me, Mega Constructs. What am I talking? I'm getting the two questions from you. Mega Constructs is very close. I think they just need to improve their brick quality and tweak their instructions a bit, and then they are on par. In my opinion, the figures may be a little bit tighter joints, maybe a little bit more friction in the joints, and they are better than LEGO figures um, and playability standards. But, of course, in my mind, LEGO minifigures are always going to be that nostalgic thing, and I, I don't think anyone will ever do that. So, yeah, LEGO. Um, where did you get the name Mega Maniacs? Is it because you're a Mega fan? This is an odd story. So, I have had so many names trying to... I, I, I came up with the idea of doing YouTube back in December, I think, of 2019. And I decided I wanted to do YouTube. Um, my first one, my first name I thought of was The Rookie. Yes, my name was going to be The Rookie. Simple as that. And then I thought of Commander Mega as my next name. And I was good with Mega, Commander Mega for a while. And then I decided around last minute because everyone in my family calls me a maniac because I am just, I, 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 I am crazy. I, I'm very active. So they call me a maniac. Which is, it, it's a joke, it's not, they don't actually, yeah, but it's like, it was a little joke that was passed around, and I decided to add it on to my name, so yeah, Mega Maniacs, odd name, still even don't know why, so it's a unique name. Um, funny enough, funny enough, um, yeah, and also, call me a Mega Maniac because I bought a lot of, stuff and I am a maniac with that. I call myself a maniac. It's nuts. But yeah, a bit of an abstract man. Funny enough there's actually another YouTuber who I outgrew that had the name Mega Maniacs. Um I don't know. He abandoned his channel so I don't know but yeah. Um and then thank you do you like deuces? Don't does I I don't know, let's move on. I spent a lot of time on this question. JLF Productions asks, Do you want the the, the new Mandalorian Bell Pack coming in 2021? What the f What battle pack? Oh, are these these fake rumors that were spread around? Yeah, there were a bunch of fake rumors that were spread around saying that they were true. Um, he made the mail or a bell pack this year. So, are you talking about that this one? Because I have it. I don't know. I'm thinking he's talking about some rumors. Some fake rumors. Because, yeah. Lego did not announce that. So, um, but if they did, yeah, I would. Oh my god, JDO asked another question. <laughs> Um, and, and Lego Gunner. So Lego Gunner asks, he, he, he's awesome, go subscribe to him, asks, why did you start your YouTube channel? I already answered this. I wanted to give my opinion to the world. And because I, I wanted, because mainly because of Watermelon. And of course I started stop motion because of cool guys. So, yeah. 
and then Fun J, aka JDO, asks again, "Why are you so good at stop motion? Can you give us a, a, a tutorial? Because I'm trash." Funny enough, that's a video I've been planning to do for a long time. It's just I'm not I'm not that good in stop motion, and you're not trash at it. I think you could use a, a lot of work, but you're not trash. But yeah, I. And I'm just a dude. I'm just a dude. I mean, I have I've been doing stop motion for around two years at this point, just doing little animations. I still have them. Maybe I'll make a video where I look at my first ever stop motions. Clearly, JDL needs it. Um, and yeah, hashtag you're not trash. Um, but yeah, it's, yeah, that's a video I've been planning to do for a while. So. Yeah, maybe here in a few days. Um, I can maybe yeah, here maybe here in a few days, so hope you do that. Let's go ahead and go on to the next question. A fake solid brick studios asks, When will you do your first UCS set review? I have a question for you. Why are you faking being him? You know how wrong that is? I hate you. Okay, but I will answer your question. When will you do your first UCS set review? Um, I don't know. I mean, I don't really get the UCS sets. Mainly because they're too expensive. The newer ones since I got them. But although the A-Wing is in a good price range. So, maybe the A-Wing... I think the most likely one is the Gunship in 2021. Yeah, let's move on to the next question. Gaming Time says, congrats. Thank you. And then his his question is, what is your favorite LEGO set? LEGO set. Uh, my favorite LEGO set is the LEGO Ideas Voltron. Yeah, it, it's the LEGO Ideas Voltron. Yeah, I've been watching the Deckflix Voltron series lately, and that's really good. So, yeah, if you haven't watched that, go right ahead and watch it. It's pretty good. It does get really stale at the end, though, but the first couple seasons are really good. And if you're a fan of Voltron, I would recommend it. So, yeah, let's go ahead and go on to the next question. Top Break. T tip Top Break? I think his name is Tip Top Break. Um, I'm sorry if I said your name wrong. Says, says, also, what's your favorite Lego minifigure? My favorite Lego minifigure? Uh, I don't have too many varieties of Lego minifigures. But the two-tone Airborne Trooper I love a lot. Um, I, I have a lot of Lord of the Rings minifigures. I even have some TNT. Um, yeah, it's, it's odd, but I have a bunch of Harry Potter minifigures. Um, favorite her minifigure that's not Star Wars is probably gonna be, uh, CMF series Voldemort. Um, it's just such a cool figure, so yeah. Go ahead and go on to the next question. This is one I get a lot. Um, hashtag in the stud shooter. Yes, we need that. Um, by the way... If you're watching this video, I'm doing a stream where we talk about that. So, yeah, if you want to join that, and then maybe we could talk there. But, yeah. My thing is, do you think we'll ever do a collab? I have 40 or 39 or 38. I don't know. <laughs> oh, my God. You don't know that. That, that cracked me up. That was funny. Um, now, but... Don't now. Don't know, but... Anyway, I hope we can I can work with you and basically you started a month ago. Wow, that is awesome. Color Mirandy? I'm sorry if I'm saying your name wrong. You you were hey, you're the first one to be nice about it. Everyone wants to just like collab, 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 collab and it's and it's getting annoying, but um no. No. But we can talk in live chats, and I can give you tips so we can talk in live chats and stuff. Yeah, I'm perfectly okay to help you out. It's just I don't 
think I could do a collab at the moment. Maybe in the future. But again, I don't know how. I don't even know how to live stream at the moment. So I'm going to figure out live stream. And then I will, I will get on to trying to figure out how to do collabs. So yeah, let's move on to the next. Wow, we bitch. Wow, 20 minutes. Okay. <laughs> wow, this is a long, longer video than I thought it was going to be. Okay, let's go ahead and move on to the next question. Next question that asked me the last question, and this is from Little Jack 24 Productions. If you could get one minifig from from minifig for you or any company like CAC minifig for you, what would it be? Well, I already answered the CAC one. Minifigs for you. Um, I want the fives. <laughs> that five figure looks really cool. Fives or Commander Sorn. From minifigs for you um i'm gonna actually answer from bricklink because it's a company so can i answer from bricklink um but to figure out like the most from bricklink would be the uh, phase two command captain rex so yeah let's go ahead and end out the video so guys i hope you all enjoyed that was every single question i got um, I'm sorry if you guys didn't get a chance to submit your questions. I'll be doing another Q&A for 100 when we get in and we see uh, we have 60. So, yeah, shout out to all those people in the video. Go subscribe to them. Accept the fake salt. Just proof. This guy is fake. This, this guy is fake. He could stop. But, yeah, he, he gets it. Yes, he is. Yes, he, he, he is pretending. To be someone he's not. So, yeah, don't subscribe to him, but subscribe to everyone else. But, uh, yeah, hope you all enjoyed. Again, I will be live streaming talking about stop motion. The end of stud shooters is um, movement, mainly the main end of stud shooters movement, and our next plan of attack. And, yeah, I'll be. Talking about the delayed sets, I'll be talking about my CAC order, I'll be talking about what my new newer video plans are, and yeah, it's just going to be awesome. If you want a general update, um, just go watch that stream, it should go live, hopefully around, my goal is around 1 or 2, if it's not up. By one or two, I mean, it might be running late, and if it's not up by three, like three, three thirty, uh, it, it did not work. Um, so I'm using, I'm gonna use Streamlabs. So you can comment on this video if Streamlabs works. So yeah, I'll see you all next time. Bye bye.